Thank you, Luke. Well, good morning, everyone. How many of you care about your future? All right. How many of you believe that every student in this auditorium is created in the image of God and deserves respect? All right. I believe that, too. And one of the reasons I'm involved in School Choice Week in uh, co-chairing along with Senator Tim Scott, who's a great advocate, isn't he? It's because I believe in the fundamental importance of families being able to choose their future, choose their school, and have the opportunities that best fit their needs. Now, I learned that firsthand as a parent when I had a daughter who was in elementary school was pretty much bored in her classroom. They really weren't challenging her and exciting her about learning. And she heard about a new school nearby that had just opened up a charter school. She heard that they got to use microscopes and really uh, excited about their learning. And most times as a parent, you don't kind of follow your elementary school's recommendation, your elementary child's recommendation on their school. But in this case, we saw it was so important to her, and such a motivation. We had her go to that school. And she thrived there. She did so well in math and science. She ended up going to West Point and serving our country and the armed forces. And I say that because as a parent, you have a responsibility to raise these children and do what's best for them. And I don't think anyone knows that better than your family and you to know what the best fit is for your education. So that's why I'm a strong supporter of school choice. I serve on the Appropriations Committee, which oversees the Department of Education. And we're going to work very hard to make sure they're accountable to the American people and to you as students, as parents, as teachers, to make sure we do the right thing for every student in America. So thanks for having me. Great to be with you. And have a great School Choice Week.